What's up guys, it is Ethy, and this month marks four years of me being vegan, right? And I haven't completely uh, deteriorated yet. So, um, today I'm going to give my um, health results after four years of following a plant-based diet. And yeah, the only animal products I've had, um, and I could count probably on one hand the amount of times that this has happened, but, you know, just accidents with like, oh, you order something and they say it's vegan and then it turns out to not be vegan and you don't find out until after you've eaten some of it or, um, you know, they tell you it's vegan and even they don't know it's not vegan or, you know, some stupid shit like that. But yeah, nonetheless, uh, predominantly plant-based, right? For four years and nothing fucking happened, right? Um, or nearly nothing happened, right? So when I was beginning um, in my vegan journey, um, I did feel sluggish at one point. I don't even know if this was because of veganism. It would make sense if veganism played a, um, a key part in it or just like my um, wrongdoing of veganism. Um, I did it wrong is basically what I'm trying to say, or I did the plant-based uh, diet wrong, and that's why I was feeling sluggish most likely, because once I started eating like a more of a variety of foods, I stopped feeling sluggish like that. I, I only felt sluggish like that for like a small period after I first went vegan, um, and it wasn't even right when I first went vegan, um, but you know, after that a little bit, you know, I did start feeling sluggish, but that um, nonetheless went away eventually, and I think that is because I started eating more foods, um, but yeah, other than that, no health effects have really happened, if anything, I felt more like negative health effects when I was a non-vegan, I remember, um, and, and I know this isn't representative of all, like, carnist diets, as is, you know, a lot of people's, um, gripes with, like, the vegan diet, a lot of their gripes aren't even, like, necessitated within veganism like they're like oh yeah it's unhealthy to eat a bunch of bananas well you can be vegan and not eat any bananas so i don't really see how that's an argument uh, against veganism or going vegan but i mean like yeah uh back when i was like 13 um because i'm 17 now um and i was a non-vegan i remember even eating like mcdonald's burgers and then afterwards i would feel like oh my god like i feel like shit and it wasn't even for ethical reasons it wasn't for like oh i care about animals it wasn't even that i care about my health it was just that physically i felt like shit for some reason and i would realize this and i would say hmm, okay well i'm gonna like next time i do this i'm gonna see if after i feel like shit and of course it worked i'm not sure if it, that was just kind of a like a placebo but you know nonetheless it is something, and, you know, uh, I'm not trying to grasp at straws, I'm just kind of, um, giving carnivores what they give, you know, you get what you receive, basically, and carnivores always talk about these anecdotes, oh, this is what veganism did to me, well, I felt more, um, negative health consequences from carnist food than I have from vegan food, um, but yeah, Nonetheless, that's not even very informative because someone could give me some vegan food that was like poisoned in some way or the vegan food was just tampered with and then it makes me throw up. It's like that doesn't necessarily mean that veganism is bad. It just means whatever they put it in it was bad and that happened to be vegan. It doesn't mean that veganism as a whole is bad, okay? Um, when you want to make an argument against veganism, you actually have to make an argument that attacks veganism, not something that is um, extrinsic to veganism or it's not entailed with veganism, uh, just like the crop deaths argument, for example. And I know that I probably have a lot of carnies uh, in here, that's why I'm kind of talking about this. Um, so the crop deaths argument is not an argument against veganism. Um, they're basically trying to say, oh, well, uh, you think killing cows is immoral? Well, uh, you, you know, somehow do the same fucking thing by, you know, killing animals um, when it comes to crop deaths. Well, the crop deaths, uh, it could be said that they're necessary for increasing the overall well-being and, and uh, um, improving the uh, um, quality of life for these animals. And it's actually conducive to what? Um, to animals... Um, as a whole, because when you're buying vegan food, you know, through capitalism, you're changing the capitalist system, and it could be said that those deaths were necessary to change the institution, as you need to change the institution from within the institution, and that is, of course, how we do it, so when we're buying vegan food, that pushes them, um, you know, more up the market, and then beats out the carnist uh, corporations that kill even more animals, and also, um, you know, 
do it much more horribly and uh, it's also more like intentional right um intentionality is kind of like a hard thing to gauge i do know that sometimes um you know the crop owners will intentionally you know kill um you know the fucking uh, rodents and snakes or whatever will be in there but um from what i've seen and the data I've seen, the crop deaths aren't very high. And even if you do have a problem with crop deaths, you can be vegan and not cause crop deaths. So I don't really see the contention. Um, but yeah. Uh, but that being said, if you're f like fucking with animals unnecessarily on your farm, I do think that's a problem. But I wouldn't say it's not vegan to support that because veganism is just a, a set of moral beliefs. It's not morality as a whole. I think once you equivocate it to morality as a whole, um, uh, it basically all falls apart and it becomes harder to prescribe. But yeah, it's basically the end of the video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Veganism didn't do fucking shit to me. I know I have uh, some acne, but you know that's probably just because I've been not eating like the right diet recently. I do eat like whole foods. The majority of the food I eat is probably whole foods, but I do eat um, too much junk food than I should. Um, but yeah, have a nice day or night, everybody. Make sure to check out the Discord, like, comment, share, all that shit. And yeah, fuck you.